Now, we can't talk about this season of celebrations without talking about bachelorette parties, baby. Now, when it comes to... Yes. When it comes to destination bachelorettes, there are a few unexpected options worth considering. I bet you haven't heard of, of a few of these. So, here to tell us about them, Lorraine Simpson. Hi. fun and unexpected places and the first place we're going to is the east coast the where east are we going coast. oh well let's get the party started yeah. Tracy. we want a bit of a wine tour or in this case not even a wine tour it's a brewery tour we're going to learn yes. about alexander keith Yes. Okay, 1800s, and we're going to hear the history of Alexander Keats. And after your history lesson, you're going to go and taste a ton of the beers. And then, of course, my favorite, shopping. Shopping oh, on the okay. boardwalk. And it's such a gorgeous area to go mm. to. Now, after that, hmm, you might want a little bit of food, but you're going to have to work for your food. Okay. You're going to go... <laughs> on a 37-foot lobster boat. But this is no relaxing excursion. Okay. This is going to be work. <laughs> you are going to be the ones that are measuring them because the small ones you have to throw back, right? Uh, oh, yeah, so you're going to measure them and then you're going to put the little elastic bands around the claws oh, as long Lord. as they don't pinch you. Okay. And, but you'll be rewarded. Okay. When you go back to the hotel, you're going to be rewarded with a beautiful lobster feast. Oh, that's it's cool. Be really that's cool. an experience it's and that's what you want to look for, right? It's Exactly. The East and Coast of Canada, so cool. I say, are the nicest Canadians. And yeah. I'm sorry, don't at me for that. Yes. <laughs> but it's the truth. Lovely people. Okay, where are we going to next? Okay, so five hour flight mm -hmm. all is all to go to Iceland. Oh, yes. yes. Okay, it's not too far. Yeah. And if you have an adventurous bride, you know, we're thinking bachelorette party, of course. Yeah. If you've got somebody who's super adventurous, then you're going to go hiking up to an ice cave. Now, Ooh. the spectacular visions that you get in these ice caves and the hike itself is absolutely glorious, yeah. but you can stay there overnight. And then you oh, can really? watch the Northern Lights, especially if you go between September and April, you oh, can watch nice. the Northern Lights. So it's a really good visual out of the box experience that you can really enjoy on your bachelorette party. Now, let's talk again, you know, we're going to talk about the booze. Let's mm -hmm. talk about the nightlife. Yeah. Well, Iceland is the top safest destination in the world. Beautiful. That is what's important. Okay. When you're traveling, you want to know that you're going to be safe. And the nightlife has to be great, right? You're going to enjoy this experience and have a little bit of fun and the outdoor activities. A little bit of both. Beautiful. The topography yes. in Iceland is just like phenomenal. You yes. go, every area looks like it's a different country. So yes. I think that's beautiful. Yes, okay, uh, where are we going next? Okay, so we are going even more adventurous this time. Okay. And we're going all the way over to the west coast and up a little bit, two hours north of Vancouver. Yeah. And then you're going to hit Juno. Juno. Juno is typically Alaska. Alaska. It's typically a cruise destination. Okay. Have you ever been on an Alaskan cruise? I haven't. That's where you would stop. Yeah. But how about just going for your bachelorette party? Now we're talking extreme adventure on this one, okay? Oh yeah. So you can go hiking looking for bears. What? Yes. <laughs> now I don't want to find them. Well, you're not bringing. <laughs> your honey it's, it's a, a very, very good, good idea oh my God. <laughs> you know? so after that if you survive that then you can take a <laughs> helicopter and what a go party. <laughs> you, you're gonna go dog sledding and you could even have a picnic yeah by seaplane so you go over to somewhere really remote that's kind of and cool. you're gonna have a picnic with freshly caught salmon because you're in Alaska that's right. right beautiful scenery again now not forgetting about the party side I'm not forgetting you going out it's loads and loads of bars the nightlife is hopping okay. it's really really fun and it's a cool outside of the box destination for your bachelorette party. You've really brought different ideas. I've never heard of any of those mentioned for a bachelorette party and I love that and I want to get a read from the audience. <laughs> Who are you people? Okay, what would you vote on uh, out of Nova Scotia, um, Iceland or Alaska? Who wants the Nova Scotian uh, bachelorette party? Okay. Who wants to go to Iceland for the bachelorette party?
Don't bring them home. They can't get over the border. We don't want them here. Lorraine, thank you so much.